and I think life is abrasive, and I think you learn lessons with a degree of abrasiveness. I think if things are too soft and too well explained, you don't learn them. Yeah. I, and, and you can apply that to nearly anything, right? You can go driving your car and drive fast, and you can nearly lose the tires 10 times, but you're not gonna stop driving like an idiot until you hit a tree. Mm. And then you're gonna be like, okay, I've learned my lesson. The Matrix is trying to control your mind. They're very good at it. That's what they do to control all of us. You have to break the trap. If you cannot control your own mind, let me make this, this point because it's extremely important. If you cannot control your own mind, then you are just a feather in the wind of life because your own mind is the only thing you can control. You can't control the weather. Right. You can't control other people. You can't even control whether your heart stops beating. You might have a heart attack tomorrow. You can't control anything besides what you think. If you cannot control your own mind, then you go through life with zero control, zero influence. You can't control anything. You're just a feather in the wind waiting for life to blow you from happy place to sad place to happy place to sad place, completely hoping on the gods to be fortunate to you because if any genuine discomfort comes your way, you're fucked. How can I comply, 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 and stay weak and stay stupid and be safe from, from tyranny? And I say to you, you can't do that. That's why I teach the tenants I teach. And that's also why I think they find me so threatening because I'm teaching people to, to, to do exactly that. I say, listen, there's no strength of mind or strength of opinion without strength of body. First thing you do is go train. Don't care what you think. Don't care what you think. Too small. First thing you do is go train. This number one. It's hard and I was trying. All garbage, all code. And like I said earlier, life is war. If you're a man and you don't view the world as war, I can't imagine how you view the world. My entire worldview is war. Well, you're hot, every man wanted you, I got you, I won, that was a war. My Ferrari, everyone wanted it, I bought it, I won, that was war. Along with all the residential properties I own, along with the commercial properties, along with all the domains I own, yeah. along with fighting the matrix and the legal system, that's all war.